Hello and welcome. In this video, we're going to discuss learning activities and what it means for a learning activity to be meaningful. Let's get right down to it. To begin, I'll provide a definition of what we mean when we say learning activities. A learning activity is any type of task that gives the students an opportunity to actively acquire new skills and concepts covered in the modules. Learning activities also provide the students with an opportunity to practice applying any new skills or concepts that you've taught them. In short, learning activities allow the students to learn and practice new knowledge and skills. A key element of learning activities is that all other students are participating and interacting with you, the instructor, with their fellow classmates, and with the learning materials you've provided them, all in an effort to learn something new. To better understand what we mean by learning activities, consider the following list of examples of learning activities you may already include in your classroom. Small group and whole class discussions, simulations, case studies, individual or team projects and presentations, research papers, student demonstrations, and lab experiments. Notice the emphasis in these activities on the students' involvement in their learning. Each of these learning activities is centered on the students and requires them to be accountable for their learning. Not only do student-centered learning activities require active student participation, they provide an experience for the students in which they can recognize that they are actually learning something new and valuable. Additionally, Effective learning activities assist in your role as the instructor by helping you guide the students in their learning and to determine when and how to redirect them on the path toward acquiring new knowledge and skills. Now let's shift our focus to creating meaningful learning activities. On the previous slide, I mentioned that we're focusing on meaningful learning activities. A meaningful learning activity provides students with an opportunity to gain and practice new knowledge and skills. In other words, a meaningful learning activity actually helps students learn. We've all been in at least one class where we were given an assignment that was just plain busy work or otherwise didn't relate to the topic of the class. I'm confident that your assignments certainly don't fit into this category, but for the next few minutes, I'd like to discuss what makes a learning activity meaningful. My hope is that you'll reflect on your existing learning activities and start thinking about ways to improve them by including most or all of the attributes presented here. I think you'll find that these attributes are somewhat common sense ideas, but when they're combined with careful reflection, they're powerful for designing and developing learning activities that will help your students succeed. If a learning activity is what we call authentic, then it is considered to be meaningful. In this context, authentic means that the learning activity should reflect the types of experiences, problems, or challenges the student will face in real life. For example, if a student in a technical management program will someday have to complete a performance review of her technical staff for her job, the learning activity should be as similar to that real-life task as possible. It could perhaps involve them completing a scenario-based performance review. Meaningful learning activities should also be challenging. The learning activity should provide the right amount of difficulty to help the student grow to a new level of knowledge and ability. Meaningful learning activities also have to be rigorous. In rigorous learning activities, students are required to apply their understanding of newly learned concepts and skills in order to achieve a successful outcome. In other words, if a learning activity is rigorous, students will not be able to complete the activity without having learned the new concepts and skills from you and the course materials first. Coherent. In the graduate level courses I help design, it's common to have project-based activities that have a lot of moving parts, so to speak. Meaningful learning activities are coherent, which is especially important in large-scale, multi-part, or otherwise complicated learning activities. To be coherent, all parts of a learning activity should have a logical and consistent relationship and guide the student to achieve stated learning objectives. Another characteristic of meaningful learning activities is that they're engaging. The learning activities should pique the student's interest. If the students find the activity to be interesting, they will be motivated to actively participate. There is a strong correlation between student motivation and student learning. Students always want to know how they're doing in their coursework, which leads to the next attribute of meaningful learning activities, responsive. 
By this, we mean that a mechanism that provides frequent feedback is built into the learning activity to guide the student in the learning process. Meaningful learning activities should focus on the learning needs and goals of individual students. If possible, activities should be tailored for a specific group of students. In other words, activities should be student-centered. And the last attribute I'll mention sort of goes along with the concept of alignment discussed in a separate video. Meaningful learning activities should be valid. The valid learning activity guides the student to achieve the stated learning objectives. The purpose of the activity and its relationship to the stated learning objectives is explicitly stated. Now that you have the full picture of the attributes of a meaningful learning activity, it's clear how incorporating these characteristics into your learning activities will help you and your students succeed. As you develop learning activities for your course, ask yourself these questions. Is my learning activity authentic, challenging, rigorous, coherent, engaging, responsive, student-centered, and valid? That's all for this presentation on meaningful learning activities. Please post a comment if you have any questions or concerns. And thanks for watching.